Rain Island, off of the Great Barrier Reef in Australia, is a biological hotspot. In a single year, up to 12,000 green turtles will nest there. It's the highest population of nesting turtles in the entire world. Here, tiger sharks also actively consume green turtles. And in this turtle nesting season, they have huge amount of opportunities to feed on live turtles. However, when they're laying eggs overnight, the turtles can sometimes get weakened and enter the water and can even die if they get roll over and die of heat exhaustion and the high tide will then wash them into the water, providing both scavenging and feeding opportunities for the sharks. So we were interested to know if the sharks were primarily scavenging on those carcasses or looking for the weakened individuals or if they were taking advantage of this huge food pulse of live turtles. Our behavioral data from satellite tagging suggests that during the nesting season, the tiger sharks are primarily there to scavenge on the dead turtles that get washed in their water, as well as potentially the weakened individuals that make their way into the water. They're probably having to patrol the, the island, wading through hundreds of live healthy turtles on a given day. And this is really interesting. It's probably because scavenging on the dead turtles, although fewer an opportunity, save them time, energy, and increase safety for the sharks. Our data also shows that as a result, the healthy turtles probably don't perceive the sharks as even a, a risk to them. This research provides new insights into the behavior and ecology of apex marine predators and shows that they might be more similar to terrestrial carnivores like polar bears, hyenas, that when during a food pulse will opportunistically scavenge instead of actively hunt.